guys it's Marianne um, thanks for coming back to my channel um, <clears throat> so there was some I just wanted to do a kind of a quick recap of um, yesterday um, some good things um, some things I'm gonna try and work on a little bit and um, maybe not too many bad things um, so good things um, first is that I finished <laughs> and I finished um, an hour and two minutes under the six hour time frame that I gave myself. So um, that's good. So that kind of gives me confidence that I can, that I can finish um, on race day <clears throat> because <clears throat> it is both a full and half marathon. So um, you have six hours, whether, you know, whichever one you're doing. So <clears throat> thank goodness for that. <laughs> um, <clears throat> maybe, maybe uh, someday soon I'll be able to finish within like three or four hours I don't know what it is what time frame they give you if you're just doing half and that's all it is <clears throat> but um yes first first and foremost I finished um and let's see um two I'm not actually very sore today which is surprising I thought I would need a couple of days to recover but I feel okay my hips felt a tiny bit stiff this morning as I got up but as soon as I started moving around you know just getting up getting ready doing things <clears throat> um uh they you know it subsided and just felt normal um I do have a tad bit of tenderness on the balls of my feet but I don't feel particularly sore in my feet at all um my little pinky toe that I call the boxer <laughs> um is a little bit sore like not it just feels like it rubbed too much on you know on the side of my shoe or something like that but I mean if the only sore thing you have like you can that it officially is sore in your mind is a pinky toe I think I'm doing all right. <laughs> um, let's see. Uh, well, I didn't cardio wise. I felt like I could have kept running. Um, even if it was just short bursts, you know, or short distances of, um, of running. Um, I felt okay cardio wise, but, <clears throat> um, and then what's another good thing? Oh, good thing is um, I felt like I hydrated well and um, and um, had, you know, had my snacks down and stuff like that. So um, I didn't feel like I was, you know, unenergized or anything like that. <clears throat> so those were the good points. Um, things I want to work on. Um, let's see. I think now that I, I know that I can do 13 miles, um, I, um, I'm going to maybe do one more long run, but no more than 10 miles. Um, and, and then I'll just, I'll throw in, you know, some two miles, some three miles, seven miles, you know, um, until then just to keep running you know just to I don't need to worry about that anymore so I'm happy about that um of course just keep on strength training with my trainer obviously you know when I was started with him a few like I think it's four weeks now um I was barely run walking five miles and now I've survived 13 <laughs> um <clears throat> And that's a lot to do to him. He's whatever he's doing, he's doing it right. And um that's why I trust him. He knows what he's doing. Um and uh you know just and try not to be so whiny to him sometimes because nothing he has made me do has been worse than that. <laughs> um but uh yeah, he's uh yeah, so just just keep working my trainer and giving all I got during the time that I have with him. And let's see. Um, what else do I want to work on? I think that's kind of it. Nothing too crazy. 
just, you know, just running. That that monster in my head saying, you can't do 13 miles. There's no way you can do 13 miles, you know, is gone. He doesn't exist anymore because I killed him yesterday. <laughs> um, yeah, because I can do 13 miles and I can do it in under the six hour mark. So, um, on race day, uh, you know, I'll just know that I can do it <clears throat> and I'll just keep pushing. Um, that's something I was really proud of myself because at mile 11, I really wanted to quit. I really just wanted to say to heck with it. And like, I can't do this, just quit. But, um, I didn't. I just pushed through. I just kept telling myself that I could and that, you know, I, I had the ability to, and if I just kept putting one foot in front of the other in a relatively, um, constant pace, I can make it, I can do it. So I did and I did, <laughs> um, so yeah, it's like, oh, and, uh, yeah, so I was, I was really happy that I just kind of pushed through because I'm not good at that. I'm not good at pushing myself, putting myself out, out there, getting myself out of my box, all that sort of stuff. I'm, I'm very much a giver upper a lot of the time. I, I don't like to be uncomfortable. I don't like to be unhappy or, well, not unhappy. That's not the word. Or I, I just don't like to be challenged in a way and, you know, <clears throat> And I was yesterday and I pushed myself through it and I made myself do something I didn't think I could do. Um, so yeah, kind of, kind of proud of that. <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, the only bad point I have to say about the run yesterday was that my feet hurt. Um, you know, that was the only thing that made it challenging was that at mile 10, my feet started to get a little bit, you know, tired, sore. And then between 11 and 13, they were aching. They like every step was hurtful and it was owie and, <laughs> um, and, uh, yeah, I don't know if there's anything I can really do about that. You know, I'm the size that I am and I'm guessing that's just going to be something, but yet, like I said, I push through it. So I'm hoping that just from now on the, with the, with all the other running that I'm going to try to do that, um, that my feet will just get used to it. They'll get stronger and you know, I can deal with it. <clears throat> So, and plus, you know, I'll have my partner, running partner with me, so we can kind of push each other. I don't know what's going on with my hair today or here. Or, I don't know. It's just not behaving. Um, <laughs> and, um, yeah, so hopefully we can push each other. We can distract each other from any discomfort we may be experiencing and, you know, get, get to the finish line together. I don't know if I'll be able to run to the finish line or at the finish line. But either way, I will cross it. And that's nice to know. So, yeah. Happy about that. And just... Those are the things that I... Um, like I said, the only bad thing I experienced yesterday was my feet. So... And I get a little bored, I have to say. Because the... The laps... The laps <laughs> that I took were around a, a lake. So, it's 2.23 miles. Um... No, 2.3 miles. <clears throat> so it, uh, you know, it kind of got boring after a while seeing the same scenery. So hopefully, I don't know the course of the race because I've never run a race before. So hopefully it's maybe you go out to halfway and then you turn around and come back. That would be fine. Um, or maybe hopefully the laps are only like two or three. <laughs> That'd be nice. Um <clears throat> So yeah, so those are the good points, the bad points, the things I want to work on um, from here on out. But the monster of not being able, you know, you know, 
telling myself that I um, can't do it is gone. So that's nice. And um, here on out, it's going to be fun. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, race race day is coming up quick. Um, a couple, like three and a half weeks, maybe. No, three weeks. No, a little over three weeks. Um, so, yeah, October 21st. Ooh. <laughs> and, um, yeah, it's going to be, it's going to be exciting <laughs> but yeah it's coming up quick so I'm just gonna work as hard as I can um, to prepare because I know I can finish so it's just can I finish better than five hours and if I can great but if I finish in five hours and 59 minutes that's finishing too so it doesn't matter <laughs> anyway guys I uh, hope you are having a great Wednesday great week um, it is Wednesday today right I think so <laughs> Yeah, so hopefully you've had a great day and a great week and you've gotten your exercise in or you're running in or whatever. Um, whatever it is that you like to do or that you're just having a nice day. I don't care. <laughs> um, not that I don't care. That's the wrong thing to say. I mean, <laughs> I mean, whatever you're doing, I think that's what I meant to say. Um, yeah, so uh, have a good week, everybody. And um, I'll talk to you again soon. And yeah, thanks for watching. Like, share, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. <laughs>